Callahan's first look is presented by Nissan. Indianapolis in town to face the Titans on Sunday. We could see Joe Flacco at quarterback. He threw for 359 yards this past Sunday in Jacksonville. Or we might see second-year quarterback Anthony Richardson, who's trying to come back from a hip pointer. Richardson is big, he's fast, and he can throw the football as far as any NFL quarterback needs to. Where does your defense's challenges begin, Brian, if Indy goes with Richardson? Well, he, he's got such dynamic ability with the ball in his hand, and you have to make sure you're assigned right for the quarterback run game, um, all the different ways they use him in that facet. And then on top of it, he's big, strong, and fast, and he can make huge plays off schedule and outside of the pocket uh, on top of being able to throw really from anywhere on the field. A really, really dynamic player. Uh, that again, just hasn't been healthy for long stretches, but, man, he is really special to watch. 6'4", 245. People don't realize he's that big and that fast. Well, no matter who Indianapolis plays at quarterback, that player has several outstanding receivers, Josh Downs, the speedy slot, and then the larger targets. Big time Michael Pittman and big play Alec Pierce. How do those guys stress an opposing secondary? Well, it's a well-built receiver room. Um, they all have different talents and unique ways to be used. Uh, you see they all have different skill sets and they have speed, they have possession, they have size, they have strength. Um, they got guys that have quickness and suddenness, and and they're all homegrown. They're all their own. They, they're all draft picks and players that uh, they've built around, but uh, made a lot of plays, made a lot of tough catches. Uh, both Pittman and, and Pierce are, are fantastic, and uh, yeah, they they stress your defense all the way around because of the versatility and the dynamic difference in skill sets of the group. So uh, yeah, we have our hands full this week. It's crazy with Pierce right now. I think he's averaging like. 27 <laughs> yards a catch or something ridiculous like that? Explosive. He's... Yeah, explosive to say the least. When one starts discussing the Indianapolis Colts defense, you got to start with their linebackers. And I'm talking about number 44, Zaire Franklin, number 45, EJ Speed. They are two of the leading tacklers in the entire NFL. Why are Franklin and Speed so disruptive? They do such a great job within their scheme. They know how to play the defense. They have a ton of confidence uh, in, in the scheme and what's asked of them. Uh, and then on top of that, they got great physical gifts. They can both run sideline to sideline. They're very physical, but you can see what sets them apart uh, is their intelligence and operation in, in within the scheme where they can go trigger and make tackles. Uh, they know how to defend the pass. They know what passing concepts give them stress. Um, they're a really, really good linebacker tandem in a scheme that fits their skill sets very well. If you don't get those guys accounted for, play's probably not going to work, right? They are hard to get accounted for. <laughs> it's hard for those offensive linemen to go block them. They're really good.